Hey guys, CCG coming back at you again with a dinosaur combo tutorial. And we played, I played Dino for a bit, but this combo is actually pretty cool. And I just wanted to show it off, uh, see everyone's thoughts on it. So we start off with our Misk, and then we OV search our baby. Vanish Misk. This is all fairly standard Dino stuff. Summon Arch, Arch pop baby, add the pill, and baby into petite. Now we make a uh, Link Rebo. We OV pop out Petite, summon back Arch, make sure you don't summon back Baby. And usually you summon back Baby, but we're playing Scrap, we're not playing Scrap cards, sorry. Uh, and the Scrap cards kind of lock you. So we make these two into Alan Uh Alan Bushin, if you draw Circular, the Detach 3 to search level 4 does come up. But here, obviously, we did not draw circular, so we're adding circular. This card is crazy. And we can special circular by tribu uh, not tributing, sending sigma. Uh, so we're going to make circular into devote. And devote here, the effect is mandatory. Uh, so we can't summon link through or highs, but we can tribute devote with alambert, summon out circular, bring back our two tokens, and two cybuses. Uh, makes Wicked. Uh, this step isn't necessary, the the bring back Link Karibo, if you did draw uh, your another Cybus, but since we didn't, we have to do this. Uh, for those wondering, we're getting Wicked's effect, banish a Cybus to add a Cybus Tuna. Then these two into our Inverted. Inverted summons a Cybus from hand. So we'll summon the Diamonder. And we get to trigger our circular to add a Mathmax Fella Trap. So now we have the three, the one, the circular, the diameter, and the sigma for our super factorial to summon back three. Uh, so that's pretty pretty nice. That card is obviously crazy. So we make these two into our Sprite Elf. Uh, make sure you don't activate sigma because that'll lock you with the Sprite Elf. Uh, from making Sprite Elf, sorry because Sigma locks you into only summoning Cybuses. So summon Baby off Elf, make these two into Immortal Dragon. Don't worry, you don't have to play any bricks for it. Uh, Immortal Dragon effect, we can send Ghost Bell. So this will become the difference in original levels between that monster and this card. So it'll become a level three if you send a level three. Um, and so three plus one makes Herald of the Arclight. We'll go bat pill, s summon, and we'll probably banish inverted here for our conductor. And so these two can become probably dweller here. Uh, dweller's crazy right now. So in terms of interruptions here, uh, let's just count them. We've got the dweller, we've got the arc light floodgate and negate. We've got circular, uh, not circular, super factorial to summon back three. So this this counts as two or three interruptions because we're making DB. Thank you for loading uh, all of them into Laplacian, and Laplacian can detach up to three to send uh, one from hand, spell trap, and monster. Uh, we can elf summon back Petit Pteranodon. And then we can go Conductor, pop Petite Tyranodon, book their entire board. And then we can go Petite Tyranodon effect to summon the Dinoress Lepancratops, which is another interruption. So if we count that, that's one, two, three. And this has a negate because it has diameter under it. Uh, this effect, four, five. And if you count Laplacian from hand or field, that's six interruptions off your just your OV misc. Um, I'll go show the deck list now. Just check I'm still recording. Yep. Thank you for staying this far in. And just so you know, 7% of my viewers are subscribed. So if you could subscribe, that would be much appreciated. This is my current list. Um, yeah. Realistically, if I updated it for this format, because this is just theory, uh, I probably wouldn't be playing the Mystic Mind package, and the side deck would look different. Like, 
Actually, we'll just do an interactive side deck building. What what side deck cards I think are very good right now? I would be citing Crow. Crow is really good into the tier element. You have to be main decking the bells because uh, you have to send it off the Immortal Dragon and it negates uh, Crow on your misc. So I would probably play this. Uh, I would be playing Droplet because Dweller is a problem. And then I would be playing for back row removal. I think Cosmic is better than Twin. We'll play Twin. We'll play two Twin. So we play five back row removals, so we see on average one. And then four slots. You already know it. We're playing Gamma and Driver. So the standard Dino two card combo gets you to the board I just showed, which is a really strong board. Um, some of this is, is, uh, most of this is made by my friend, uh, I'll sh shout him out right now, or I'll shout them out in the description, and yeah, uh, this deck isn't, isn't great into tier element right now. It, it, actually, that's a bit of an overstatement. It's alright into tier element, especially since you set up the Herald of Arclight and your opponent's all banishing all their stuff. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Uh, if you want some, some in-depth dino content, more than a list that I just slapped together in like five minutes, uh, feel free. I can do budget decks. Also, don't play, uh, sorry, this card is mandatory in this deck. Prosperity is crazy. Uh, but if you're not playing Prosperity, there are some other cool texts that I can show off. Uh, I'll set a like goal. We'll do, we'll do 15 likes and I'll show them off. Uh, and yeah, thank you for watching. Have a great day.